Hey, 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 YouTube. This is your girl, Jasmine, and I'm coming at you with another video. This is a video requested by Miss Lanita Foster, and it's for a gold, orange, and brown look. So this is the look that I came up with, and um, my lips are nude now, and the, at the end of the video, you'll see they're pink, but I don't really like the pink. I don't really like the pink, so I changed it. And so my lips are um, now are with Fresh Max Fresh Brew Lipstick and Sephora Sugar and Spice Lip Gloss. Anyways, um, thank you very much again to Miss Lanita Foster for requesting this look. And I hope you guys enjoy. Comment, rate, subscribe, all the good, sh uh, good stuff. Oh my god, I cannot talk. <sighs> Show me that you love me. And of course, request more videos, please. Because I have a very creative mind, but I run out of thoughts too. So I love, love, love when you guys put your input. So I'm going to put the link right here to my request video. So if you have any looks that you would like, you can put them there. Or you can even just put them down in the comment box. If you don't feel like going to a whole other video, you can do that as well. Um, What else? All the products will be over there in the sidebar. And... I think that's pretty much it. So yeah. Let me know what you guys think of the look. And stay tuned. Hope you enjoy. Bye. Pain pop. Okay. And then we're going to take Max Amber Lights. Which is my go-to gold. It looks like this actually. I've hit pan on it. But it looks like that. And we're going to take a Sony Kashuk brush, like this one, and not gonna, I guess it is. we're going to apply that in the inner, inner half of your eye. And you can bring it up almost all the way to your brow bone and halfway over, so about right here. and just pack on the color. After that, then I'm going to take a blending brush like this one and I'm going to blend out that hard line at the top. And you could just blend it up into the brow bone. And then I'm going to take Max Orange. Yeah, Max Orange. Looks like that. And I'm going to take a different brush. Uh and I'm going to apply that to the rest of my eyelid. And the thing about Max Orange is it's not, or at least on me, it's not very pigmented. So you have to kind of pack the color on. Okay, and then I'm going to take the brush that I used Amber Lights with, and I'm going to blend the two colors together, just by bringing short strokes, bringing the Amber Lights into the orange. Okay, so this is what I have so far. Then I'm going to take a smudge brush like this one. Like this one. And I'm going to take Max Roll, which is just a darker orange. Oh no, this is red brick. Huh. I didn't know that. This is a red brick. I thought this was a different color. And I'm just going to put it in the corners just to kind of deepen up the co bring the corners a little bit brighter red I mean orange sorry so then you have that then I'm going to take another Sonia Kashuk brush and Max Corduroy which is um, a soft brown dark kind of soft brown 
And I'm going to put that in the corners as well, as well as all along the top. You're going to leave a, a little bit of room for a highlight, but your highlight's going to be very thin on this look. And also bring it down to the corner of your eye. And you're going to use the corduroy to blend out the hard lines of the amber lights and the orange. Okay, and if you feel like you need to go back and touch up some of the orange or the gold, just go in and just pat it in and break that hard line again. Okay, so you have this look, this now. For highlight, I'm going to use Max Blank Type, like that, and a smudge brush. I don't remember which one I used. And you're just going to take a little bit and place it underneath the brow bone right there. After you've added your highlight, then we're going to line our eyes with Max Dip Down uh, uh, Fluid Line, and it's just a dark brown. And I actually wanted to do a thin line, but I messed it up, so I ended up having to do a thicker line to to fix my mistake. But you can do either way. you line your eyes, then you're going to uh, line your bottom lines. Use a dark brown uh, eye pencil. This is Makeup Forever's number two. Uh, looks like... Focus, focus, focus. That. It's just a dark brown pencil. You can also use Duck Eyeliner from... Um, duck or Stubborn Brown from MAC. Okay. After you line your waterline then you're gonna take a angle brush like this one and max uh, uh, amber lights and you're gonna pick a little bit up and just line on your lower lash line right on the inside as well as your tear duct and then clean the brush off just wipe it off and take max corduroy and finish the rest of your life your eye. Okay, so now you want to add your mascara. This is Maybelline Gloss Volume Mascara Glam Black. Okay, and that's pretty much it for the eye. The is L'Oreal True Match. True Match Foundation for my powder is Maybelline's True Match powder. For my cheeks, I'm going to use Max Peaches blush, which is kind of like a orangey pink kind of color. It's not showing true color on here, but that's what I'm gonna use. It's like a uh, soft orangey pink, and that's pretty much the entire look. And I hope you guys enjoyed, and all the good stuff, comment, rate, subscribe, show me that you love me, and of course leave more requests because I love doing your guys' requests. I actually didn't think I was going to like how this turned out, but I really do. Um, thank you to Lanita Foster for requesting the look and always showing me love. That's my girl right there. And stay tuned for the next video. See you guys later. Bye.